Hey guys, did you miss me? Yeah, I apologize if it's really bright in here. The door's right over there and it's wide open. I'm really sorry about that. Now for today's maze review, we're going to be getting into some characters that didn't get a chance to be introduced and some supernatural characters. If you've seen the TV show, you would know what I'm talking about. And there's also an anime, but I didn't I didn't even know that was possible. But <clears throat> anyway, for the supernatural fans out there, this is where you want to be. Now, for the first guy, we got Jake Hammond. The luckiest got luckiest uh, messenger in the whole mace. Next, we got Catherine Inzer. Just so you know, I'm not making these up. The Jake Hammond and Catherine Inzer. These are classmates at my school, so uh, ain't way to make friends. Here we got Human Tyler in a worn down old trench coat. And we got the dark version of my character. Now, what I intended for that is to promote my idea for a video game. Could you imagine a video video game based on the base? It'll be third person slash first person, it switches in between. And, uh... And it's a decision-making game, like those Telltale wa The Walking Dead games. And also, uh... While I'm drawing, I have a really nasty habit of forgetting to draw the boots because I reached the end of the page so uh... here's the boots now we reach the main event the supernatural characters here we got Dean my personal favorite again ran out of room on the page Sam same story Bobby Castiel I'm not sure about you guys but I think I did a pretty good job again Ran out of room. Crowley. Now here I think I did a really miserable job. But I'll leave that for you guys to decide. And this character you won't miss for a mile. Lucifer. Again, ran out of room. Now, here, this next character, I, I, well, you know what? Here's my twist on Lobo. He's my favorite DC character because, well, when I saw him on the Supernat, not Supernatural, Superman, the main man episode. I thought, when I first saw him, I was like, who the hell's that guy? But then I started looking into him. It turns out he was a really badass character. So I decided, why not try to draw him like he is in the Superman series, except not 
too overboard with the with the muscles because if you've seen the Superman animated series he looks like he's taking steroids here's the boots forgot to mention now for the last character every every villain has to have a half can't even talk today has to have a lieutenant like uh, uh like on uh South Park Professor Chaos has General Desiree but that doesn't really count as a villain but anyway here's Diana she looks exactly like Mordessa. Again, the boots and her blade. Now, what she is, she's a part time executioner. So, uh, she needs a big blade for the job. Now, that's all there is for now. Feel free to rate, comment, subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.